Hey kids, today's show is brought to you by the letter 4 and the number potato! I'm a stupid private! Welcome back to the MLP Villain Countdown, time for number 18, the Red Dragon. Now this guy is definitely not a great red dragon, so the alicorn clothed by the sun has nothing to worry about. I'd call him more an okay red dragon. I kind of like how he's not strictly speaking evil, he's just a gigantic tool that doesn't give up about anyone else. So what if his snore smoke covers the entire land in a toxic cloud for 50 years that mutates the residents of Ponyville into shambling bulletproof monstrosities? Private, that's the Sierra Madre. Well, it would still suck for Equestria. And Red Dragon does not give a buck. I'm on the fence as to whether or not I liked the way Dragonshy resolved him. It was cool because it introduced Fluttershy's stare power, but it still feels sort of convenient. Design-wise, I'm not really a fan of any of the Friendship is Magic dragons. Skyrim truly has spoiled you, hasn't it? But I did like Big Red enough that I was happy to see him again when he showed up in Dragon Quest. Thanks for watching, come back tomorrow for number 17 in the My Little Pony Villain Countdown. I'm the Stupid Private. Oh, huh?